At noon, two people shot to death at a Buckhead nightclub. The medical examiner has identified the names of those who were killed early Sunday morning. And they are 20-year-old Nakiris Ridley and 21-year-old Mari Creighton. We have Atlanta News First reporter Patrick Quinn joining us live from Stockbridge. Patrick, this is just awful. Awful news, and we're starting to learn more about these victims and what they were experiencing late Saturday night, early Sunday morning. I actually just talked with the older sister of Mari Creighton, who died while celebrating the birthday of her niece, I am told. And the older sister told me they're very frustrated right now. They know that there have been problems at this nightclub historically, and they wish that the city had stepped in earlier. They tell me that 21-year-old Mari Creighton, she had a bright life ahead of her. She was set to graduate from Albany State University in December, but she was gunned down uh, on early Sunday morning. There were six people shot, two people who died. You just mentioned those two names. Four others were injured, including the niece of Mari Creighton. I'm told that that niece is in, still in the hospital, but it's expected to be okay. Police, they are still investigating this. This is an open investigation of a late night nightclub shooting. They do not have anyone in custody. Here is some of the conversation I just had with Mari Creighton's older sister, Talia. She's just bloomed into this beautiful, smart young girl that I just, you know, she was used to be so shy and timid. And it's like for the past couple of months, she's just been in her era where she was just living her best life and just enjoying herself. Um, she was going to be graduating from Albany this December with her bachelor's. And I was just so happy for her to see like what she was blossoming into and, you know, what she could have possibly become. And she was heartbroken just talking about her younger sister who we really saw as somewhat of a child of hers. She got to see her grow up. And so now today we're looking to find some answers around what the city is doing in response to this shooting. As I just mentioned, Atlanta police are still investigating. They don't have anyone in custody. Today at one o'clock, the Atlanta City Council, they have a public safety committee meeting. Atlanta police is set to present during that meeting, no doubt. This shooting will be part of that presentation. We'll have more answers on what's being done and the people who were taken as part of the shooting coming up later today on Atlanta News First. From Stockbridge, Patrick Quinn, Atlanta News First. This breaks your